I mean, with the, with the recent news that's come out about Halo, um, it seems like I don't know. Well, if let's talk about that. Doing. Let's talk about that because that's the other hope is Halo Infinite. The other hope is <coughs> Halo Infinite. Does. Oh, but Jesus we've got Christ. some news this yeah. week. Obviously, things have been looking up. So far, things have been looking good, right? Like in the sense of we know it's Master Chief. That's the focus. That's who we're playing as. Yeah. We know that yeah. already. Um, we know that they're going to go with the old art style. Now, they're, like, so there they're already some things that looked different. Like, it looked like they're going for a bit of a bigger scale in terms of missions, a bit more open world-ish. Not like open world game, but like missions are a bit more open. It's not just the linear way. Yeah. But I didn't know that meant they were going RPG. Now, the, do, do you have the article? That's the only Guys, I got every article prep for today, but I didn't get that because I didn't prep the uh, list. No, for, for I, I didn't even know there was but an article. I'll get, I, well, oh, the is tweet, the one I yeah, retweeted? Article, oh, I didn't read the Yeah, the one you retweeted. Yeah, do you want to do you want to re- do you want to read that out? Let's read it yeah, and see if we get all the information. Because I suspect, because people are worried like RPG, they assume that means leveling all that. So I I don't necessarily know. It could just be mission choices, uh, which there has been elements of in Halo as well. I, maybe it's, if it's affects story, I've got issues. But if it's just affect kind of like how you play the missions, you know mm-hmm. what I mean? Like this mission variety and the what you do, how you do it, sort of stuff. Yeah, that's not bad, and it could yeah, be that. Obviously, it but, could be that. But but would you call that RPG elements? Because yes. that yeah, but that's RPG. But every game ever has had that. It does, that doesn't make it an RPG. Well, they didn't say it's an RPG. They said it has RPG elements. But how is that they an RPG an... element? That's just a video game element. That's just every video game ever allowing you to choose just making it less linear no i mean more like like drastically affect missions i guess like Mm, i don't like that i don't know i don't know all right let me let's three choices bro let's try yeah i mean it is but also i don't don't know right okay so i've got it up here so it says um microsoft sort next gen consoles at e3 2019 um oh it's not a very long ask at all okay so it says so Uh, I'll skip to the bit about Halo. So it says, Last year, the company teased Halo Infinite, and the title would be... Who's the article by? You probably should credit Uh, that as well. uh, Thorot is the the name of the website. I don't know what that is. The home for tech enthusiasts, news, reviews, and analysis. It's by Brad Sams. Okay, shout out. From from Thorot. Um, So there you go. Um... So yeah, so it says last year the company teased Halo Infinite, the title, uh, and and that title will be la- uh, will be a launch game. Fuck me, uh, for the upcoming hardware um, with a brand new which, engine, which we talked about made sense, right? Like that's <laughs> yes. sort of already what we would guessed. Yeah. Yes, yeah, they're waiting to launch next um, console. Genius idea, exactly what you should do. Yeah, take as much time as you want, launch it with your next console. You need it. You need to sell that fucking next console. Yeah. Okay. So sorry, it says... sorry to interrupt. Go on. Oh uh, yeah. Uh, t- uh, so it says with a with a brand new engine, the team behind the game is trying to make the story adapt to decisions the user makes, and the game may have more role playing game elements than prior version versions of the series. That's all it says. The rest then goes on to talk about Game Pass. So that's all we know so mm-hmm. far. Um, is may that have the story more will adapt. role playing elements than mm-hmm. a, than prior. That doesn't really tell me it's <clears throat> level based open. You know, and I don't think that is. I'd, no. I'd if it's RPG leveling open world, it's dead. It's fucked. It's dead. I don't think it's that. It can't be that, right? Like, it can't be that. I hope not. I fucking but, hope not. How do you even do that? I mean, but how, how do you... T- if they do that, I think it shows to me completely that 343 doesn't know what they're fucking doing and they don't understand Halo at all. Because the point isn't... The point of Halo is always... For me, playing through Halo 1 to 3, the focus was always on the main story and this, you know, this journey of Master Chief. And there's these stories that you play through, but at the same time, you're always learning more about Chief and, you know, what his journey is and all these this overarching narrative that's, that, that, that can be quite background at times, but it's also very there as well. Like, it's very present. It, it always felt like that from Halo 1 to 3. Um, even Even Halo 4, I think, did the campaign well. Halo 5 obviously fucked it, but if if they're going down this route of... uh, The game, I mean, the games to me should remain linear. I don't think... Because if if, even if they go down the route of like a Metro Exodus type type deal where you've got small mini open areas for you to explore and there's main missions you do, you go to this area, you go to this area, you go to this area, you move on to the next mini open area. Um, 
where you've got little side objectives. So you've got, oh, there's may, might be like a, a camp of enemies here, or here's a cave where you might get some loot, or, you know, d different things like that. That is completely wrong for Halo. I even think that's wrong. I mean, it works in Metro, but also I think that the prior games maybe were better um, because I, I think that Linear worked better for the game that it was. Um, but, but, you know, going for these, it almost feels like, you know, with Metro anyway, like a like a, a small scale Far Cry and you've got these different areas to do these like these these small little open worlds. And I mean, it, could that be what they might do end up doing with Halo? Is like you go like the mission is this like mission one is this planet, and then you've got a small area on this planet where you can you might have like a warthog that you drive from. Well, it'll a be to like B. Halo ring. It'll be um, Halo installations. And see, like, is I don't like that. That doesn't sound right to me. No, I don't, I don't think it'll be. I think I think this game's going to be on one Halo installation. So it might be areas of the installation. You think it'll just be same in, in like one different place. environments? Like there'll be a snow environment. You know what I mean? Like. In Halo One, there's you know there's always the Halo installations have such different natural environments all over mm -hmm. them, so it'll be like that. So perhaps it's like that. It's not different planets, but it's different. Like there'll be a desert one, uh, you know, foresty areas, and yeah, it'll just it'll have variety. Yeah, I just feel Halo. If Halo's linear, I feel like it's best when it's linear. I feel that you can make more detail. I, I don't you can tell a more focused story. That's what I think they mean. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I just I hate that. If that's for the I I hate. I hate, I don't need any RPG elements. I don't care how small, yeah, I don't sure. need any of them. I don't understand yeah, why yeah. they can't look at, this is what Halo is, let's do that better, rather than let's change that. Why can't you just do that the best way that you can? Just because you fucked up 5, doesn't mean the formula's wrong. It means you fucked it. Just do it right. Yeah. Why are you then yeah. going, oh, we need to add, you know, you can change the story. Like, what? why? We don't need that. Yeah. Now, to be fair, in this sense, in this sense, Halo Infinite, <clears throat> Halo Six, whatever you want to call it, yeah. If it just has all those RPG elements you were saying, you know what I mean, like a bit more open world and stuff. Mm -hmm. Obviously, not what I want. But if it's all the story's not shit, like literally, it's just not shit, and you only play as Master Chief as a playable character, it is better than five. You know what I mean? I would like, forgive it's still it if the story is good. If if the if they do all this and like I obviously I don't want like leveling up and oh you get new gear so you change Master Chief's armor and it looks different and all of this shit because I feel that oh, Master yeah. Chief's armor is a huge part of who he is. Like I feel if you're changing that you just fucking you fucked it. But if if you know if there there are these open areas where you've got little you can explore this big open space you can focus on the main story if you want but you could also then if you want you can go and find like weapons in a cave or like you know some some loot somewhere else or like a camp of enemies or stuff like that if that's what they go with but the main story is really good and they nail it and they get master chief exactly right you only play as chief um the story that they do feels right it connects to the other games and everything and that's all great then I would forgive the new direction because I would because at least they've got it right. They've got the tone right. They've got the direction right. They've got Master Chief right, and the story's actually interesting and good. Then I would forgive this, and I'd be like, actually, yeah, fuck it. You do whatever you want, but as long as the story fits and it it's good, yeah, then I, yeah story's definitely more happy. important to me. Yeah, I think so too. I think yeah, Halo. Yeah, that because that was the big issue with five and. I mean, four, oh, the story's horrendous. Yeah, like four the was, worst. Four was well made, but I also not don't just, think not it just was... a shit Halo. Like it's just a shit <laughs> yeah. story in general of any five game. Is, five if is any dreadful. game came out with that story, terrible, yeah. horrendous in every way. But <clears throat> yeah, like um, yeah, uh, yeah. I mean, it could it could, it doesn't even, dude. Honestly, it doesn't even have to be good. Like if it's just not shit, it's better than five. Yeah, it doesn't yeah. mean I like it. I was yeah. like, well, it's still. Better than five. No, yeah, of course. But if it's, it's... you can only go up as long as you've got Chief as the main character in the whole game. You can literally only go yeah. up. Yeah, I mean, um, but what if the Chief, you play as Chief for the whole game, but Chief is just shit, and they just fuck him up, and he's not yeah, like oh, Chief, yeah, and you, you you talk to like you can get side quests from these NPCs, and Chief is just talking to these NPCs, and you have dialogue options, oh. and like he's just talking to everyone. He's just a fucking loudmouth in this game. Yeah, uh... <laughs> that would be worse than five, I think. Yeah, yeah. Well, I mean, yeah. I don't know. 